you crying? Why? Hungry. <laughs> Wait, crying in the Momoka video. Tata, I've never seen that before. You okay? That looks so good, though. Konnichiwa, <laughs> minasan. Max desu. Suji desu. Watashi dashi no shena wa eiyoku so. Another day. Another Momoka <laughs> Japan reaction video. Thank you, Momoka, for making such amazing video. So, ready wa ikimashou. Who is ready? Ah, 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 how are you doing? Good. Yeah. Yeah. Happy to be here. How are you? I'm uh, Cormac. I'm from the United States. Oh. We are here in Tokyo with a school trip. Oh. oh. Okay, that's good. How long have you been in Japan so far? This is yeah our third week here. My name is Adrian. Uh, hello, my name is Samuel. Uh, I'm you look like anime. Excited to be here. Is your first time in Japan? Yes. 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 Your first time in. Samuel, it looks like Japanese style. Yes. <laughs> right? Yes. How you enjoying being in Japan? Love it. Very fun. It's really Love cool. it. Very fun. Do you also like Japanese food? Yes. 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 Very good. Very good. <laughs> I have I have not had one bad food here. You are trying oh. Japanese seafood restaurant okay. today. Okay. 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 Uh, uh, this is the restaurant we're trying today. Uh, like the seafood. If she bring you for seafood, are you gonna go? Of course. Okay, because this guy he not really likes squid. No, I don't. I don't like squid. Yeah. <laughs> I like fried squid, but I don't really like squid because I don't like the texture. Sometimes it's really uh, weird texture. We haven't been to a seafood restaurant in Japan yet. Oh really? So our first, yeah. Can you help me? Oh, help. Yeah. I need the. Whoa! What? Very cool. Very no, cool. it's like street like, food or not? Like yeah, yeah, that's what we're here for. Like Is it in a good yeah. way? In a good way. Yeah. Good way. Good way. <laughs> I'm hungry, so in a very good way. Okay. We spent most of our time in Tochigi. So not as much fish there. So really? Like, we you stand in Tochigi? Yeah. But they have a good beef and good. veggies yeah. and yeah. the food. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of food, what is your Everything favorite is good. Japanese food? Probably just ramen. It's a basic answer, but... Yeah. <coughs> so I haven't had any Japanese food before I came here. So all the food I tried here was pretty much new for me. The thing I like most is the, the like the rice with the tofu skin, the sweet. Ah, uh, inari sushi. So good, it's so good. I oh, you like that one. I didn't like sushi very much before we came here, but having sushi. like real actual tofu. sushi that's mm -hmm. not from America, it's, it's very good. I like it way oh, better now. Like I really now? like sushi now. I would say also I really like ramen, but like also the tempura. Where are you from in uh, America? We're all from the Midwest. From the Midwest. Yeah. We're all like two hours away from Chicago. Like, yeah. did you grow up eating fish or not at all? No. no. We don't have fresh fish. How you feeling that you in Japan? Uh, I don't want to leave. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I like Japan a lot. I don't know. I just enjoyed my time here. I don't want to leave. And then you told me that you're hungry now, you right? You will be back. So I have to go there. You guys can talk. What do you want to talk about? Talk about Japan, maybe. We, it's, been, it's been a very interesting trip to the see Tokyo and see rural Japan so we've seen the contrast I think we've seen the cultural the diversity in culture a little a little differently here and I will say Japanese culture a lot of similarities to the US but I think there's a lot of differences a lot of respect a lot of respect, yeah. respect. I, I love bowing I love no. <laughs> very respectful. Every, everything's more reserved yeah. like we feel always are the loudest people <laughs> everywhere we are I know I try to be much quieter Suji tell me that all the time <laughs> Why are you so loud? Well, because I'm Canadian and we speak Ooh. in French Canada, yeah, we speak loudly. I think he's dead now. <laughs> I, I'm becoming yeah, dead. Yeah. There's a lot. We're loud too when we react. <laughs> Especially me. Yes. In the US, there's a lot more. You just kind of get in other people's faces. Sure. Sure. There's more consideration here. Yeah. Any food that you yeah. cannot eat? You eat everything? I'm, I eat everything. Yeah, we're okay. No, I don't eat everything. No, no, no. no, no, no. no, no, no. Well, I'm really excited to eat. Tokyo is like easily like the biggest oh, city like because even like Chicago, Chicago the suburbs Chicago. of Chicago are nothing like the suburbs yeah. of Tokyo the well, suburbs like, of Tokyo like well, it feels still, like you're still like, in the so middle part of the city of Tokyo. Chicago. it's like Chicago LA New York combined that's Tokyo yeah it's wild wow well, one of the reasons is because there is more diversity in the United States. There's more ethnicity. Mm. There's more people from all around the world. And a lot of people immigrate to America for the American dream. So in the same city, you can have two different sections that look very different with different skin color and different yeah. ethnicity. And it's different from Japan, I think, for that. Now I noticed something behind him. Is the hanger? Yeah. The clothes hanger. But maybe it's cold. Amazing! <laughs> I don't know they don't hang their clothes. Really hungry. Okay. What did you guys talk about? Uh, we were just kind of rambling, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's been three weeks. You already know a lot of about Japan, right? Okay, so being so, being someone from Chicago, 
I would say people in Chicago and people in Tokyo are very different. If you come from America here, the first thing you'll notice is people are a lot more considerate of yeah. like what mm -hmm. you yeah. have to do. If you go to a, a grow, like a 7-Eleven and mm -hmm. you get uh, uh, something to drink, they're not gonna say thank you. They're here, they always say yeah. like, have no. a good day. Yeah. So just like the little things like that. Mm -hmm. I think the culture about around like respecting other people is a little different. I don't speak Japanese, so there is a, a language barrier, but I mean, I've even been surprised by that. Going to places eat, like restaurants or stores, like one thing is like they always ask if you want a bag and they'll point to the bag, like make sure you know, and then they try and help you communicate. Yeah, even. People who don't speak English very well still will try to speak to you in yeah. English. Yeah. In, in, in America, I feel like if we see someone who doesn't speak our language, we just won't talk to them. <laughs> That's what we won't talk yeah. to them. Or we assume that or, they should speak or English. Or just say, like, you're in America, you need to speak English. Yeah. I think it's a lot of people's so, opinion. Mm. And so it's, yeah, it's nice that people like... They want to connect with you. They, yeah. And a lot of people, everybody always says, and I don't know why Japanese people do this, they always say, Sorry, my English is really bad, but they then they have really good English. Yeah. 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 Yes! Yes! yes. yes. <laughs> That's Suji. Suji so English is very good and she's always talking like this. <laughs> no, actually, this reminds me of one of our subscribers. Yes. She said her English is really bad, so she always keep talking in like a Japanese, but then yes. she sent a voice message about something that... Uh, yes. And then her English is like, what? This is like a fluent in, yes. in English. You guys, you need, you need crazy? To, I think sometimes Japanese will lack confidence. You need to have confidence. Sometimes your English is way yeah. better than you talk. Yeah, yes. crazy. <laughs> they don't need to say that, they right? Their English is good. Their English is good. The fact that they're trying is no, just really good. And the fact enough. that they even like know enough to say like, yeah. oh, my English yeah. is really not good. I'm like, that's more than I can say. Like, <laughs> I, I tried to speak. Yeah. yeah. Like I can't apologize for my Japanese. Uh. I'll also say one thing I really appreciate about Japan um, is being someone from America. Mm -hmm. Our culture has only been around for 300 years. Mm -hmm. The way people like Japanese people have been living in the same society for thousands of years. Mm -hmm. Like they can interact, and, and the way they interact and they treat each other with respect is mm -hmm. very different. In the U.S., we're still trying to understand who we are in a lot of things. Yeah. I think Japan has that figured out. I mean, I think your your cultural identity you, you, that you guys have that part figured out, and so that I, that's why I think Tokyo. In Japan is very safe. You have lived together for so long, you understand what it means to live together. Um, in America, we're still trying to figure that out. Mm. We still conflict Aww. here. I he's so right in everything that he's saying. He's talking about how Japan has been around for such a long time that they had time to figure out who they were as a like yes. as a population, and also they are kind of separated because they're kind of an island in yeah. a way. America is a lot bigger and has not been colonized that long ago. So no, Japan know, was a long time ago, but like, you respect know. for everybody. Mm -hmm. You guys are very, very much the same people. Your ancestors are the same. Uh, anything surprised you about Japanese? Well, yeah. something that surprised me was food portions. So small. Yeah. Are so much yeah. Yeah. So Like, small. even yeah. at like fast food places that we also have in the uh -huh. US, like everything is just less. I think, which I think is, again, I think that goes back to one thing I really appreciate about Japan is Japanese people are very health conscious. They yeah. think about what goes in their body and they really care. Yeah. Like food, the food here is a lot cleaner in the United States. The mm -hmm. diet here is a lot, a lot very different. And I think people just care more about what they eat. When you went to the United States, what did you see the differences? Like I'm, I'm curious what differences you saw. I think American people are more like louder, happier, yeah. Yeah. and yeah. more cheerful. I think that a very big difference between uh, Jap Japanese culture and American culture is don't, being emo showing emotion in public. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's very different in Japan and America. That's why we're so loud and very energetic because we're more used to showing you know happy emotions. Uh -huh. you, in America, you'll see pe you'll see people fighting in the street, mm -hmm. laughing in the street, like every every yeah. emotion. People it's having like a breakdown, crying. <laughs> right. As a Japanese people, like we have to hide what we really think, mm. so we yes. don't really say what we think. Yeah. Yeah, and I, I think it's just a respect thing. I think, yeah, I think, I think Japanese that's... people don't want to be so... See, you need to understand that. It's true that it's respecting, but it's also creates a situation where the other person might misunderstand what you're feeling yeah, because you're not actually... telling that person. It creates a scenario where you might think that someone don't like you, but maybe that person don't... It's not true and that person like you, but you did not communicate well and you misunderstood the... Uh, or facial expression or something you no know? but in the other hand i think like for a person that talk really straight sometimes they need to you know slow down a little bit things before speaking like like i think it it, it also happened here too i i feel like japanese sometimes when they speak they're gonna think a lot they're gonna think like oh this this word even it's like 
the truth is it going to hurt that person so they are trying to to be really careful yeah because i'm at the mentality that if yes. you if you speak straightforward to people the truth to their face you're going to save a lot of time if you go around the subject two or three hours later you you're still not sure that this person understand what you were what you, to say. you you're not going to know what what happened after that to them <laughs> they want to disrespect everybody else they don't want to bother in america we kind of don't we kind of don't really care if we disrespect other yeah. people. To be well, I don't think it's necessarily about disrespect, but I would just say like if her, if people her. don't like not in a bad way, but like people don't. I the word is like don't care. Like I don't really care if somebody else sees me sad because yeah. I don't know them. So it doesn't. It won't affect yeah. my life if they see me sad. So and that's kind of what what you talked about earlier about consideration. I think that just in, in general, like people in the United States are less considerate and maybe not necessarily in a bad way, but they don't think about like how this is going to affect somebody else. Yeah, mm. I think there, there can be good and bad. It's yeah. like that. Yes, there's good and bad of both. I, guess. I, I agree with him. Yeah. <laughs> oh, miso soup! Salmon? Rude to smell food. You can't oh, okay. smell food! Okay, I didn't know. Sometimes people... Is that miso soup? Oh, no, no, Bro, look at that. Look at Please that. Please, Salmon? Like, this is the biggest salmon I ever seen. Yeah, like, that looks so good. I'm gonna just... Are no, you alright? Oh. 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 Shrimp tempura? Yes. I'm so excited. Whoa, there's something so in this. Is deep this is fried shrimp. This is traditional Japanese dish called Nitsuke Salmon Belly. Nitsuke. It's the fattiest part of salmon. So, first thing is fast. Do you know what? Which kind of fish it is? I don't know. Not a one But things that we don't really She live. told us before. <laughs> well, we don't have much fresh fish. Any fish that we have is like, is, is like frozen fish. This is. Bonito. Bonito. You never seen the fish flakes on top of takoyaki or no, we have not. Oh. Bonito. Yeah. Oh, anywhere you living tomorrow? You say? Yeah. Oh, oh, you are lucky. Oh my now God, you miss so many Japanese food. No, no, now we have to come back. Right. <laughs> but anyway, this is a bonito, the fish that you never tried before. Okay. Let's try it, shall we? Let's try with ginger on top, man. Okay. Ready? Ready? Oh my word! <laughs> it goes. I thought it was gonna be more chewy than it was. Mm. That is good. Oh my god. That is so good. <laughs> the skin has a lot of flavor. Mm -hmm. Really? Oh my god. The skin is so good. Yo. Is it fire? Yeah. Yes. 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 Really? Yes. <laughs> so fire. Oh my god, that was so good. Oh my god! <laughs> it tasted like it wasn't, it wasn't fishy. Yeah, it was so good. Oh my god, that's so good. I like it. Very good. Very good. Oh. oh. I think you're gonna like this one then. This is also bonito, but it's deep fried. Oh, deep fried. That's gotta go crazy. Deep fried bonito. Can you see something Wait, on top? It's raw, right? It look raw. Yeah, it's a medium rare. Medium rare? Oh, it's so good. It's Statement. And I don't lie, I'm being honest. That was <laughs> <laughs> it's fried, but it's so not like heavy. Like fried food in the US is so like mm -hmm. it's very light. It like gets you, but it's like oh, it's still very refreshing. Very it goes with rice, yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah. Really good with chopstick again. I'm yeah. really curious what this is. Because if I look at that, I would <laughs> it looks like mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> oh really? Oh. This is grated radish, yo. Oh it's for radish. 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 It's true that it looks like potato. Oh, oh, oh. Baby, right? Of salmon is so fatty, juicy. Mm -hmm. So the radish freshness. Oh, okay. But it is easy, like same with this. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, oh my word, yeah, that looks really good. That <laughs> looked insane. Never seen fish like that. Go try the soup. I did try the soup. It's so good. That's so good. Fire. Oh, that looks. Oh my word, this looks so good. Whoa, you got a big piece. <laughs> Yeah, Don't worry, let's see how the meat. Yeah, go. Oh my gosh, that's so good. <laughs> <laughs> it melts in my mouth. That's crazy yeah. good. Oh my god. It's much more rich than, than it in like the US. It is, it's it like falls so apart. much more real. It's Bro, like this the is not a salmon. I don't believe you. I don't. This is. This no, can't this be is salmon. So I don't believe you. You're lying. You took me somewhere else, bro. This is not salmon. <laughs> it's so good. It should not be that. You truly really not even exaggerating. Yeah. That is so good. Oh my god, the fat, the salmon bellies. I've never had salmon belly before. Uh -huh. it's insane. I know what I said earlier about the other fish, but this is the best fish. I've ever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna keep changing. I'm gonna keep changing. Every time we you okay? <laughs> if you great. didn't know, salmon is Suji's favorite fish. By far. <laughs> I'm crying for you. You're crying? Why? I'm hungry. <laughs> Wait, crying in the Momoka video. Tata, I've never seen that before. You okay? That looks so good though. <laughs> oh my god, this is going in the end show. So she's crying. <laughs> Very good. It's really salty too. Don't lie. Because it's the rice together. Uh, I think she said that this is the part of the salmon that is a, has the more fat in it. Belly. Yeah. I'm yeah. So yeah. happy. We're so. Oh my god. Thank you. It was amazing. It tasted like. Imagine if they took like salmon mm. and then in between each part of like the, the muscle grain they put butter in. Yeah. It. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Butter for sure. Like just tasted like buttery. And like salty too. So salty. Salty. Uh -huh. not Do you put butter? Not very uh, I would hate to have a seafood food. allergy. Right yeah. <laughs> wow, that looks that so clean. Looks that so looks good. Tart, it looks tart. like tartar sauce. Oh, that's tartar sauce, y'all. Yeah. Yeah, a sure. lot of uh, eggs inside yeah. and mayo. The Japanese mayo. Oh. Japanese pickle. And you know, I think it's difficult from foreigner sometimes to find restaurant like this yeah, because I feel right. like this is really traditional. <laughs> You're still crying. <laughs> this is still authentic, so it's difficult to find by yourself those kind of restaurant. Yeah. Because I'm sure in, in Japan they also have restaurants that are like trying to find foreigners, so it's going to be in English and everything, the menu, but this is more traditional and more like, uh, it's not a mix, it's truly like Japanese, Japanese, you know? Mm. Yeah. I want to have that. Japanese, Japanese. Oh my god. Everyone watching is jealous. Uh, yes! That look, that look insane. Oh yes, he's talking to me. Very good. Oh, wait, I didn't eat the head. Yeah. Go for it. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> you regret it? Better, no. worse than the better, bar. worse, better, worse. Yeah, you gotta be. Be honest. Gas. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. Yeah. It's like. These are like, they're so crispy, uh -huh. it just it tastes like chips. Normally, I do not like the shrimp very uh -huh. much that we have in the US. Uh -huh. Really? That one's very good. I was kind of nervous, but that's very good. Wow. Very good. There's just a huge difference between like fresh seafood yeah. and seafood that was fished like four weeks ago. ago. How is your Japanese food experience going? Amazing. So very amazing. good. Very good. It. So good. It's also just interesting to see like the differences between like the Japanese food that you can buy in the U.S. and, yeah. mm. uh, and what we actually mm. did here. Last but not least. Last but not least. Yes. Yeah. That thing is so bizarre. Ooh, this is traditional <laughs> Japanese dish. This is egg, right? Look like egg. Nitsuke. Yeah. Nitsuke. Sauce is like a teriyaki sauce. Made from soy sauce, sake, sugar, and broth. Is it sweet? It's sweet. Okay. It's happy. Oh. Let's cut it. Oh, it just oh goes. Yeah. Oh, that boats so well. We don't, we don't need a knife. We don't need a knife. We need, need a chopstick. Well. I've been most excited about eating this. I've been looking at this the longest. Do we put it with the it rice? It does taste like Yes, you can eat it with rice. Oh, it's really good. Yeah. Mm. Oh, it's really good. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Sausage is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Oh, so good, though. It does have that sort of barbecue, like mm -hmm. sweet sauce. That. So good. Yes, that was so good. Mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> good. <laughs> so happy. Very good. It's so good. It's interesting because none of it tastes very like fishy, but this all has like its own flavor. It's, awesome. yeah. it's like very, different. Very it doesn't different. just taste sort of like fish. Yeah. You tried everything today. Yes. But how was the experience for you guys? Oh, very fun. So, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. Really, yeah. yeah thank honestly, you so like, much. So really. appreciated. Yes, this was. This is a uh, very. Very special. Never I'm just especially because like you couldn't, you literally could not get this. No, like I. This is just so you different. Could, uh -huh. You can only get this yeah. in yeah. Japan. Yeah. yeah. Amazing. I have a chance that I gonna need to eat like Japanese food in Japan. I think I'm gonna cry a lot. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for watching. <laughs>